Morning guys, Dave Northeast Edible. Happy summer to you. Solstice was a couple days ago, so uh, longest day of the year is coming gone. Kids are probably out of school, all that good stuff. So summer's here. Just wanted to show you a couple things first. Update on right here, you can see the black locust fence post trees that were used that were hopefully molding into fence posts and you can see how thick these guys are they're pretty straight not not uh, straight up and down like a milled piece of lumber you'd get but specifically that one right there and these guys here are looking really good that one's got a little bend to it but if you remember back to the winter when I did a couple pruning uh, pruning cuts on these guys you can see there's not too many branches right up here we got a couple branches we'll have to trim that guy down but if you if we pan over to here this guy right here has all the branches left on there and we did that for you know kind of experiment trying to see does it really make a difference pruning those branches and if so what can we see a difference after just basically less than a year so a couple things at play here and maybe this is a better idea here but these guys right here are uh, same thing all growing out of those root suckers so um, yeah you can see these guys a lot thicker than say this this guy right here uh, and these these all have the branches on it so a couple things the pruning does work it does help to keep those those trees straight and all the energy goes into growing that that trunk and you can see the difference between that guy and these shorter ones second point why we're doing this video is you gotta watch the prickers here but if you get in right here you can see this this viner trying to climb up this tree and it's doing a great job so be careful of this i forget the exact name i want to say bindweed as you can see this thing circles young trees and it happens all the way at the base here um, these guys have a way of just climbing up the tree so just keep an eye on on your young trees specifically your your fruit trees your berry bushes these will given the time you know this is i'm six feet tall this is about my height this is probably five feet up in the air uh, this wasn't like this in the spring in the first in the spring so it's been just a couple of months these things grow like crazy and will will basically kill or stifle or really knock back a young fruit tree or a berry bush or um, really just smother any tree that you're trying to encourage so keep an eye out for uh, I believe they're bindweed but I'm not 100% sure on that uh, but yeah if these these vines kind of wrap around around the the trunk of your tree and they'll they'll uh, do do a world of hurt to young trees so dave northeast edible this this guy necessarily isn't you know a high value tree but if it was one of your real young apple trees or plum trees or peach trees or a berry bush that got suffocated that got kind of snuffed out you'd be upset about it so i'm uh, i'm gonna prune this guy back prune off all the limbs and i'm gonna get rid of this bindweed or what we think is bindweed and clean these guys up and hopefully have another couple trees that we can use for posts in a couple years and we'll uh, keep you guys updated so happy summer to everybody and grow some trees out there subscribe to the youtube channel email list all that good stuff share these videos and take care guys have a great day